Hello, in this video I will talk about provisioning templates. Provisioning templates and portal managers are used to streamline and automate configuration for multiple devices like that allow the admin to do configuration in one place and assign it to all or to one or more portal gates and this configuration will be applied to these portal gates. That helps in automation, saves time and is very useful when doing zero touch provisioning. So we have many types of templates with the in device manager provisioning templates as you see here. We have the tunnels template, T1, system, static route, and TLI template, and many more like BGP and PostGP. Okay, so we'll do a system template for example. Uh, there is a default template, we can modify it and assign it to any port gate, or we can create a test template as we are doing now so for example we can set the dns so in this case the dns will be 2.8.8.8 and 1.1 for the second room also we can um, change the for example the admin settings https port port 3 will require the host name so we can ignore this for now so any setting we uh, configure here will be configured on the port gates when they are installed i will keep the dns for now so this is the template that was created which has only dns configuration i can assign it to the devices that i have and it's assigned to these three port gates. If we go back to the device manager, we will find that the provisioning template is here. And the config status is modified because the DNS in this template was not pushed to that port gate. So if I do an install, as we said, it's like under device manager, it's device level settings, so we only install device level. So if I do this as we see the install preview on the three port gate is setting so the port gate three has already the primary is 8.8.8 .8 .8, so it's only setting the secondary as we see so if we install it to the port gate it will push the dns chain installation is done and we can finish all is finished now so if i go to this port gate and change the dns as you see it's now 8888111 as in the template so let's say i need to give this port gate a only for this port gate the primary dns should be something like this if i do apply and install the port gate one as you see, there is changes detected in port gate one. But the install preview is, show, is showing nothing. There is no preview for, for this port gate. Why? Even though, and if I do an install, nothing will be pushed. Even though this is different than what is in the port gate. Why? Because whatever configured on a template, on any of these templates, that conflicts with anything that I configure on device manager or in Fortigate directly. When I do an install, whatever is in the template will, will override the configurations that is here. So this can never be pushed from the Forti manager to the Fortigate. To fix this issue or to solve this issue, for example, in this template, by specifying these six values will do 8888 on all the port gates that are assigned to this template and no way to 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 do something else to configure something else because the port manager will over always override the changes and push these changes so for that there is a feature in port port manager called metadata variable where you can create a variable mapped to this device and 
as you see here, any any field that has this magnifier and dollar sign inside it, you can like this. You can specify a specific value for a specific property, and that can be created from here by clicking by typing dollar sign. This will appear. You can create the metadata variable here. I am using this variable with something being pushed to 40 gate one. It has to be 192.168 or something like that. You can give it a default value. So if anything is not in the 30 byte mapping list, is not in this list, it will use this one. So now I'm using DNS from metadata field as the primary. So that means when I install the device setting, the template will send to the 40 gate, whatever is in this value. Also metadata variables can be found under policy and object, advanced metadata variable. That's the variable that we create. Okay, so if I do an install, and then install device setting, Now it's showing me the DNS that I want to send. So back to this template. Any change to the DNS, so this 1.1.1 will be pushed to all other 40 gates. This variable here will be depending on the value for each 40 gate for 30 byte mapping. Thank you for watching. In other videos, we'll discuss other topics. Thank you.